right, welcome to the morning show. Good morning. With Sarah and Sean. And check it out, we got our giant orange juices. And uh, so we don't get mixed up. Yeah, because I that'd be gross. put an S for Sean on mine. And I've got an S for an Sarah S on mine. For so Sarah. Yeah. We'll totally know. Because I don't wanna I don't want you to get me sick. Yeah, no germs. Yeah. No uh, <laughs> no sickness. Here, let me put up a defensive barrier here. Defensive so uh barrier. that's right. It's, <laughs> you're breathing on me again. I told yeah, you about that. Stop that. <laughs> yeah. yeah, Bill Cosby said that a parent with one child isn't really a parent. They have no idea. Because they don't hear this. Stop it. You're touching me. Touching Mom, she's touching me. Stop touching me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay, great. So now we've got the orange juice out of the way. It's Let's just do the prize thing okay. first. We had a little contest where you got to pick one of these things. One of right? these cool, awesome... Space Marine Grab Box, Dark Heresy Book, Empire Griffins, Ghouls, or Cahorn Demons. That's right. And how do you pick? How do you yeah. choose? Well, there They're were so there cool. were over 50 entries. Which is cool. Thank you. Yes, thank you, everyone that entered. Very fun. So uh, I read most of them, skimmed some of them. Skimming is like reading, but without the comprehension. <laughs> and, um, Are you sure you want to say that? Yes. You're supposed to say, just Listen, like in college, on the thing, I read all of your reports. I went through them. I care what you have to say. That's why I could never be a college professor. Yeah, I could not lie, seriously but... read all those things. I just couldn't do it. All right. I'd have like a paper shredder. <laughs> oh, That's I skimmed them. No, you, you, you have to read them. You do. All right. So here are the runners up. These are not winners of the contest but they were good uh, here's one from uh, Jack and I'm just gonna paraphrase he and his friend were playing a game and they needed to make a um, they needed to make a bridge put a bridge in the middle so they sawed the gaming table in half and so, so I don't know how this worked but somehow they spread it out but they didn't put anything to support it in the middle it was just like barely in place and so in the middle of the game he reaches across to grab his dice or something, and <laughs> everything uh, takes a tumble. I he can writes, see that happening with a uh, Yes, <laughs> with one of those things. At first, TikTok. we feared the worst as the casualties mounted, but soon we laughed it off, and with a bit of glue, everything was back to normal. So that's from Jack. O only a runner-up, not the one we picked. But a good story. Uh, Thank you, Jack. Here's from uh, Pi the Menacing. Uh, he entitles this story uh, Chicken Raiders. And uh, what it was is they were they had a shop and uh, a game shop next to uh, Kentucky Fried Chicken. And they played a game where they, uh, they would try and slip a piece of popcorn chicken into the other person's vehicle and, uh, and then leave it there because obviously it would smell pretty bad. And evidently there was somebody who was kind of a bad sport. And so they slipped a they slipped a piece of popcorn chicken into his Necron monolith. <laughs> <laughs> so again, Pie the Menacing, uh, very good. good. Didn't didn't quite make it. That was uh, uh, that was a top that was, five. That was great. Uh, okay. Yeah, let's not do that one. That's too long. Uh, oh yeah, here's a fun. This is the cat one. This is from uh, code name Anchor Wine. And uh, basically, Maybe they're once. they're playing a game, and the cat jumps up on the table and plops down, and they don't want to uh, disturb the uh, irritable feline, so um, they just kind of play around him like he's a mountain. That's great. Now my cat would have been knocking off pieces with the tail. Yeah, exactly. Now, that, mean, would be, no that would be that would be fun. No way we could have played around that. Um, now, most of these oddly Oh, were... and I don't have a cat. I used to have a cat. Yeah? I've already said You're not I don't the cat have lady anymore. anything but a fish. Okay. And, uh, yeah. Because so vegetarian that, cause cat lady... people say things, they'll be like, wait a minute, that girl doesn't have pets. She doesn't like animals. Because they saw it. Oh, the another... earlier thing. Yeah. Used to have a cat. So, uh, th this is a bad luck story. And again, I'll paraphrase it, because these are huge. I mean, it would take like 10 minutes just to read it. So basically, his friend shows up 
to a game of Warhammer Fantasy with a like a little to uh, helper from. piece. Oh, it's from Colin in Australia. Hi, Colin. Hey, Colin. Um, and uh, basically, it's some ghouls, and they panic. And in Warhammer Fantasy, if a unit panics, it starts running through other things, and then they have to take panic checks. So basically, the, it's long story short, the unit it runs through his whole army. <laughs> They're yelling, "Run! What? Run for the hills!" <laughs> and he loses the game like on the first turn because of rolling panic from these uh, from these ghouls. Uh, the stupidest git of the army named Zog yells, "Leg it!" I don't know what that means. Ran past oh, them, Leggett. pointing wildly behind them and yelling, "Yah!" So anyway, good image. Yeah, you like that.